let's jump into Da Vinci. figure out an issue in Da Vinci, it can sometimes feel like there's a big huge rain cloud above your head. If you've recently run into this issue with not being able to attach transitions between your clips in Da Vinci, that's what we're going to be solving today. Let's jump on over there. All right, so now that you guys are in Da Vinci, I just have this clip of cars passing by, this guy, and a traffic light. So I thought it'd be cool to make a transition between the two clips, but when I go to drag my transition between the two clips, nothing happened, and that's the problem. Nothing happens. So we need to resolve this today in DaVinci because you might be running into something similar and it's actually super simple to fix. First, before we solve the problem, you gotta understand why it's happening. The reason why this is happening is when you create a transition between two clips, there needs to be excess media handles. Wait, wait, wait. You, you don't need the technical reason. Let me just tell you why it's happening. Okay, so the reason that it's happening to you is very simple is that you're using the original clips, the original B-roll that you started with. You didn't make any cuts or nothing to the clip. It's just the full clip. And that's it. There needs to be some sort of cut on the footage in order to create the transition. The reason why this is, I have no idea. You ask the people that created this stuff. But if you want to solve the problem, all you really got to do is create some sort of cut. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go to a scene where there are no cars on the screen, like right now. And I'm just going to cut up my clip. So I'm going to delete the second half of it. And I'm going to do the same thing with my second clip. And let's just delete the first half. Now we'll connect the two clips together and we'll throw on this block glitch effect that we were trying to get beforehand. So now you can see that it just dragged and dropped super simple and easy. You just needed some space in there to create the transition. And now we can actually drag out the transition. And what you'll come to see is you can actually only drag out the transition as far as you made the cuts on one or both of the clips. So this is as far as the transition goes. You can make it any shorter than that, but that's as far as it goes. And now we got a nice smooth transition on here. So nice. That's the reason why you were unable to transition between two clips in DaVinci if you guys got something out of this video, as usual, don't forget to drop a like on the video and subscribe because I'm going to be making a lot more DaVinci content and you guys aren't going to want to miss it. Plus, we're on the road to 10K and I need your help getting there. So let's go. I'll see you next time in DaVinci Resolve.